my people, I was going through my phone and I found these beautiful videos. I want you guys to, first of all, tell me your favorite outfit in this video, okay? Make sure you watch to the end. Tell me your favorite outfit. And if you're going to be recreating any of the styles. This was in 2021. Like three years ago, around this time, around April, May. Guys, <laughs> hey, I can't believe I was this slim. I mean, I think that time I was thinking that I was fat. Eh? Now I'm looking at the stomach here and I'm like, hey, God, if only you knew, Nancy. If only you knew, you guys. I used to make outfits for my pots. Like, we had seven colors at the time, and I made outfits for all of them. I have no idea where these clothes are now. I just know that I didn't give anybody. So, I'm like, where did I put these clothes? Because we need to recreate some of these videos. Or maybe I should just make new outfits. This blue gown, oh gosh, it was so beautiful. Like, in real life, well, not on video, because these videos are obviously, you know, they were shot with my phone. I didn't care for the latest iPhone those days, but, like, it did the job, because we would post these really trendy videos on Instagram, and we would get a lot of, a lot of sales, actually. People were really cheering me on those days, like, oh, Nancy, you're putting in so much effort on your brand. Wow, these videos are beautiful. But, yeah, I had outfits for all the colors that we sold <laughs> we, ah, i can't believe we had seven colors those days now we have over 12 colors we've dropped some colors obviously because you know some of them didn't sell like our pink for example i really used to like pink but it didn't sell even the shade of green our green then was a bit lighter but now it's a darker shade because nigerians were like ah it's too light it's almost like lemon i didn't like lemon but yeah Look at these outfits. Tell me, do you like them? Ah, this is my red heels. I don't even know where they are, but they were so high and I loved them so much. But I actually took out an entire day. I, I called a hairstylist. I called a makeup artist. And I even got a stylist to style five different outfits. Then I had two already in my house. Ah, that was the effort we used to put those days. For those of you now in 2024 that are thinking that content creation is very easy, you know, you can just build your brand, build your business, you're not going to have to put in any work. That's a lie. You have to work hard. Look at this black ensemble. Black is still one of my favorite colors for Radiance Cookware, by the way. Um, it's just that, you know, you have to use all your colors. If left to me, mm, my favorite colors are green, black, and burgundy. I love those colors for cookwares, for pots. Like, everywhere I see black pots, I'm just, like, in love. But, yeah, this red, ah, ah, this is my Ataru the red. It was shining like a bulb. <laughs> you guys, you have to steal these styles if you like these styles because I remember my stylist actually coming up with these styles for just me and they sold it for just me so it's not like something that you will find just anywhere if you like these styles go and show your tailor they should make it for you but yeah this gown made me sell out a lot of red pots i remember those days ah! you guys there's nothing like too much effort when it comes to your brand listen to me business owners especially when it's new mm? You've not yet made a name for yourself. You're just trying to grow the brand. Listen to me. Come outside with your full chest and advertise your products. There is social media. Social media is so powerful. You have no idea. This is me telling you that I haven't spent a dime on sponsored ads. But you see the way my customers push my brand for me and they push this much because they know that okay the person behind the brand has put in effort she has paid her dues ah those days i used to create content you guys maybe i should go back to this but i'm trying to expand but like you guys i'm going through my phone i am really grateful to god for these little days of humble beginnings like Ah, I don't know where this gown is. This gown was the ish. I need to go and recreate all these styles, guys. Tell me which one is your favorite. Mm? In the comments, if you've come this far, tell me which one is your favorite. This pink really showed me Shige. Nigerians will be telling you, oh, I want pink. I want pink. I want pink. And the moment you go and bring in a container of pink pots, that's how they'll be looking at you. They won't want to buy it. Do you know how long it took me to sell these pink pots? Ah, I really suffered. I was like, ah, Nigerians did me. They did me dirty. <laughs> I bought pink pots and they were looking at me. Eh? 
I would dance, 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 and dance, and dance in pink. Nigerians would say, ah, I don't like pink. It's for small girls. It's for, it's for young girls. I'm a matured woman. Give me red. Give me red. Red, red, red. What is it with Nigerians and red? Did they use red to do some of you? Oh, my gosh. You guys, this was the color that we had so much problems with. Right now, we don't sell pink anymore. Or we do for just a few sizes, 20 cm and 22 cm. But we have replaced pink with purple. So maybe I should recreate this video because I have a different kitchen now. And I have better cameras. And you guys, just tell me what you think. Which one was your favorite? Okay, bye.